You might ask yourself how are these sensations felt, or rather, how are these external stimuli received from our environment to the point where we feel them? The simple answer, of course, is receptors. However, there's more to the story. You see, there are different types of receptors for different stimuli, and this forms the first point of the somatosensory pathways, which of course we'll discuss later in the video. So, receptors are of four main types in the somatosensory system. The first are those used to sense for touch. In general, they are referred to as mechanoreceptors. However, there are various subtypes of mechanoreceptors, each attuned to specific stimuli. That is, those sensitive to light touch, the Meissner tactile receptors, those sensitive to pressure, the Merkel tactile discs, those sensitive to skin stretching, the Ruffini corpuscles, and finally those sensitive to vibration, the Pacinian corpuscles. The second type of receptor is one responsible for the conscious perception of one's own body part's position and movement. These are referred to as proprioceptors. There are three types, that is, those that detect when muscles are spread, the muscle spindle receptors, those that detect when tendons are spread, the Golgi tendon organs, and finally those that detect when joints are moved, the joint receptors. 